a flapping tongue that speaks without wisdom. The gods will rejoice at the words we have spoke. I give you greeting and my... A flapping tongue that speaks without... Oof. Let's see. Nothing really to... Well, we don't have any money. That's why I can't build anything. Right. Not into those waters. For honor. Let's place them outside. I don't think all of these are going to be able to like run away if you attack them. Alright. So last time we had a pretty big battle on Sicily. I think we fall uh Pushed back three armies and one navy. Uh, that was a bit hectic. Especially since the like re uh, ho horsemen and, and the elephants spawned on the map and not on the like, you know, water. I always found odd. But then again, you know, hey, <laughs> you, you can make it so that it works on a. Uh, Elephants and ships, like, you, you can't have everything. Right, yeah. Fortunately, they do have uh, another army, fresh army over there. And these guys haven't made their move yet. These guys are going to take a couple of turns to replenish. We are actually getting some pretty good replenishment, considering. Yeah, the populations are not that good here. Well, good yet, anyway. It is an honor to serve Rome. I'm going to leave them there just for now. Right, this is the end turn, so there's not much else we can do. Except see if we can get trained with someone you, you warm up yet. Nope. I wish I can... Uh, I was gonna say I wish I can feel this many armies as Carthage is, but uh, that's probably because I have one general in each province, just sitting there as a governor. We could have six armies, but I choose. You kind of want to have them sitting there to boost up your production so much. Stop, Efron. You're Iranian. How the gas prices over there? <laughs> Royal prices. That's funny. Yesterday, we got Sammy over there who's driving a company car. He so he doesn't really care. <laughs> that was the best answer I ever heard. I drive a company car. I don't care. Ah, shit. Wait a minute, how many kids do we have, actually? Fair bit. Oh my god, I think he died. Yeah. I mean, he was just about to grow up. Falling enough, I can't tell if this is a guy or a gal. Faustus Julius? I think that's guy, right? 
Yeah, so see, yeah, this is the men have middle names, right? I forgot about that. Okay, let's see. Admiral, Admiral, General, General, yeah. There are one, ones over here somewhere. That's bad. Ooh, the Empire maintenance really goes up a lot. I might actually go for this because we do need some better ships to actually fight the Carthaginians. Fight the Tyrolli. Yeah, these ones will be pretty good. Against them. I think you want to get the boats that have a, you know, catapults on them or whatever it was. Right, we do need this as well. Let's, okay, that's next turn. I think I was uh, about to switch these out because these spearmen are pretty shit. These are sword infantry. There's not much we can switch them out with. No, not the ambush. Should we ambush again? I think if you get one of them close by, we can set up an ambush again so they charge in like the last time. March until your feet then we'll march march until your feet bleed. I want to get the uh, public order in the plus here as fast as possible. And where else it's fine. At your command. And I am thinking of moving this army. Well, Sard or, wait a minute. Um, this is Sardinia, right? This is Corsica, yeah. I want to move this army down here. Finding shelter. We got Principes here, some swordsmen. Let me just check the stats on them. Right, we don't need them anymore. Since our uh, Roman troops are swordsmen as well now. Okay. Two spearmen. I think I'm going to make this army like really elite. So let's get two more Triarii. And the rest is going to be Principes. And Veltes. Can we get... No, we cannot. There are no archer mercenaries. Okay, six. Four of them. And four Veltes, that's going to be the idea. This is still good. You fucking raiding piece of shit. It's like they know I'm gonna attack Corsica and in the end they just move up armies up there, you know. But that's the idea. We wanna set up an ambush in Sicily to actually draw them in and kill them off. Then move the other army. Hmm. I wonder how many turns it's gonna take to actually get on the island up there. Got to check that first. Because I don't actually have the finances to build another fleet at the moment. I 
Now let's increase tax rate, of course. Yeah, shit. Yeah, that's what we need. Okay, we, let's increase this first. And what do I want to want up here? Right, we need the uh, aqueducts. Okay, this one has enough food. Has enough food. Okay, we're gonna build something else a little bit later. Keep. I do feel like my our trips are uh, our trips, our troops are like uh, breaking a little bit more than usual. So let's go for these two. He's just gonna run away, isn't he? Of course. the hell is this down here? All right, these guys. Let's see. How many turns was would it take? Okay, so it looks like one turn to get into the water. Probably like 3, I'd say. We should have enough for the voltage. Yes, we do. You're also leaving on patrol still. Okay, offense man. Like, funnily enough, they're not that big of a threat. They're just annoying to get rid of. It's like they fucking know. Oh, pl please move. Please move towards Rome. I wanna... I want to fight you over there. I'm kind of surprised none of the Illyrian factions actually took out Eppers by now. declared war on me by this point. Funny, funny how the AI sticks to tri uh, agreements sometimes. Command. I think we want to set up an ambush here again. We cannot pass here. Ready for battle, laying an ambush, sir. See if we can lure them in here. Fleet reporting. Six days. Six, six supplies. Or supplies for six days. Does the settlement have anything special? How can you tell that? Okay. Right, by the icon, buy it.
Okay, that's gonna increase food, so we can upgrade this as well. It's gonna take so long to get down there. food in Rome. The Yugo schmooze. These guys, I think we can get the trade agreement with them. that line of sight we definitely need line of sight I mean burn ammunition might be good like it's not that important in the grand scheme of things it's gonna be nice if we can lure them in there again for another big battle Okay, so how much can they throw at us? So two full stacks. Well, they can't actually reach up there, but the two full stacks. Well, almost full stacks. Three, four. Ah, uh, shit. <laughs> they can throw a lot. That's for sure. I think there's one that uh, increases a chance for ambush, maybe. Yes, this one. Towards Rome. Seems like it. And they're moving towards Rome with all all the armies. Ugh. But I can't really capitalize on the Carthage being well. It's not undefended, but still. This is why I need more fleets so we can actually knock out their, uh, uh, well, their armies while they're on water. They saw us. Oh no. Ah, uh, we can just get them, or just can't get them. For honor and glory. They have a fleet there. Commander. I mean, uh, if they want to come at Rome, I'm fine with that. Okay, one stack, two stacks. Three stacks, four stack, six, seven. Shit. We 
We hunger for lying in wait. At your command. They're probably not gonna go for Rome, they're probably gonna s go for Etium or uh, Beneventum. If I had to assume. Because Rome is decently defended. Finding them on the water. Well, two fleets in one army, definitely not. Actually, I think they can catch us still with the uh, with the fleets. Not exactly which, sure which uh, trait you gotta get to get in the ambush attacks with the fleets. I might need to look into that because that that's definitely gonna help. <laughs> Those pirates up there, uh, and there's pirates, of course. Yeah, civil war is what we needed. 28%. Of course, is this guy. Forgot about promotions altogether. Okay, like I said, Beneventum. Probably they have a spy, of course they do. Let's see what we actually need to get to get the ambush. Well, can't check it now. Wish we can look through those. Christ. I think I want to move these guys. Let's talk here. Then we're going to move up. Uh, 
No, they're running away. Apparently. Uh, this is a normal difficulty. Sorry if I didn't... If I was late, a bit late for the reply. You don't want to play... Do the anti pair on anti on anti guy? Well, I would actually play on a harder battle difficulty if you could like actually separate the campaign and battle difficulty though. Because the the campaign is where the difficulty is on the battlefield. It's it's the same shit. You just don't kill as many troops as you do in Vanilla Rome Total War Two. But the premise is the same. Just break the morale and that's it. You win the win the win the battle. And it's still fairly easy to do that. If you have the majority. Or like higher. Ready for orders. God damn it guys. Hide better. We hunger for Invasion force lands. Invasion force dies. Mm, yeah, these are. Pro they got the archers. Oh no! Whatever shall I do? What's up, Cobb? No, we're doing pretty fine. Let's see. Well, for some reason they bitched out and didn't attack us over there in Sicily, which I think they would actually win if they attacked that. But uh, they uh, probably the AI was probably oh we lost three stacks and one navy. A couple of turns ago. Let's not do that again. <laughs> That's probably what happened. Mm, this should be easy enough. I think I'm gonna still use the... Triari on the on the flanks, they got a decent amount of cavalry. Yeah, it's a fog, nope. Well actually maybe we should rain? Nope. Oh, and it's an uphill battle for them. Wonderful. Well, actually we're the attacker. the air just puts their elephants at, like in the middle and just charges at you it's gonna be pretty easy to take them out so let's line up our well taste for that okay they're gonna sit still for once. And military halls. Carthaginians lack all courage and pay others to fight for them. We need only kill a few for the rest to run. Make ready. He's right, you know. <laughs> you have all of them are Tribunus. paid for mercenaries. And levies. I do want to get myself some archers at one at some point. My army may not be sent, you know. Right out that well, but uh, we're fine. You don't even need to go into the 
Does the game tell me the range on these? I mean, hey, they're just gonna sit there. Oh, the pointy sticks at the elephants, guys. Come on. Good, their archers are actually shooting our uh, infantrymen. Where the fuck are they going? One of our units has used all its ammunition. Yeah, they, they, they can kill a lot if you actually get... Okay, they're out of control and they're going to their sign. Good. You just need to actually get like behind the enemy. They do a lot more damage. They want to get some archers for like picking off uh, their archers basically. And some light units. Now we get to watch this. Come on, no, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on. Don't turn around the other side, come on. The elephants regain control. That's a thing. Didn't know that. Yeah, you definitely want to... Uh, I, would, I would have recruited uh, like a two sets of slingers as well. Just because of their range advantage over Weltes and the ammunition. Uh, but uh, there are none in Rome. I didn't build the auxiliary barracks yet. I like, I like how they start charging in then they stop. Like for a moment there. No, 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 Turn around, turn around. There you go. Double time! Oh, turn. No, 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 no. Not this way, the other way. Yeah, yeah, go the other way. I think Slingers are like uh, the best early game. Well, early game if you don't uh, if you don't need to kill off enemy elephants. Ah, oh, for fuck's sakes, man! No troops, gosh. Um. Well, I, uh, I just used the Roman troops, the, the Principes. Uh, Principes has started in the Triarii as Spearmen. You just hold, uh, use them to hold the line and grab a bunch of uh, mercenaries or clients. State uh, troops for the melee. Well, at least that's what I did. You know, just grab uh, four of the Axemen or whatever they're called. It'd be fine. Okay, these don't have that much ammunition, but like, let's spread them out. It would be better if they actually charged me. I could just let them waste ammunition of the archers, but that would take too long. Okay, they did decide to charge at me.
One of our units has used all its ammunition. Or there are two cav units decided to charge at me. We await your command. Let's sandwich them. Maybe not. Yeah, they, th they think they have a ranged advantage, so they're sitting back. Ah. I do find it weird that the Equites are actually considered heavy shock cab. You know, I'm used to like, like them being light cal like in Total War 1. No, 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 we'll let them come in. Okay, all of these should be able to hold pretty well. Right, they do need to get to Warcry. Some of these generals. I do love the fact that the AI actually uses their cabinets to cycle charge. Okay, they aren't shooting at the general, good. Our general is under attack. Never mind. I don't know why they go for actually let's leave the baggage train for there so they go for that. They're that stupid. Go for that. I mean, these volunteers aren't half bad, actually. Melee and the defense. And you can push uh, the... Well, you can push the upgrades kind of fast. Not really. Actually, can we catch up to these? Okay, their speed is uh, 8. No, we cannot. Oh my god, these guys didn't break. Amazing. I'm going to actually use him in melee as well. Come on. Just, just, don't just stand there. Right. Flying wedge formation. Oh, these guys want some apparently. These are in melee, of course they are. Hey, look at that, the phalanx. Oh no, whatever shall we do?
I'm actually surprised these guys are holding this well. Never mind. <laughs> oh, there goes their whole infantry line. More or less, kind of. Okay, how about you shoot at them from there? What the f What the fuck happened here? Units has used all its ammunition. What the? What the fuck did you do? chase them down. I want to have two battles here. No good there. General is a phalanx guy. Is he? Yep. Put those down. Okay, these guys are done. Alright, oh, send those over there. Now I wish I had some ammunition in the belt to actually throw at them. Scrimmage your cab. That is going to be easy to replenish these guys. We're in Italy, of course, still. seeing phalanx is like just look at the look at them they're so fucking slow no wonder the romans conquered the world right oh no i told you to all right set them on guard mode Started to poke us. I do kind of wish the, some of these uh, icons for the troops are a little bit different. I can't tell sometimes which ones are the. Calvary, man. The battle is turning in our favor. Oh, the battle is turning in our favor. Just now.
Get this. They should be able to catch him, right? Doesn't seem like it. I'm sure, sure the can will either. Okay, there we won. Easy peasy, man. The enemy general is dead. And it is even easy. Not not. It's not that hard, even though you're like most of your armies are spear in the big spears in the beginning. Because you still only need to flank the enemy. That's about it. You don't need to do anything else. Just flank. There is only one omen to fight for one's country. Let's just take the money. At once. We hunger for well, their invasion of Italy was really successful this time around. Too bad Hannibal ain't here to like ma march across the Alps or anything. At your command. Hmm. Let's go for melee attack and uh, melee defense. Oh, Jesus Christ, I have a lot of these. for all units that seems to be the one I'm gonna go for yeah armor more armor always better <laughs> even more armor upkeep campaign movement speed Dakota morale We need to lower the upkeep a little bit. Okay, let, let me see. what Which one of these actually enables night or night battles, a lightning strike? Uh, human speed, morale, or actually it might be like on the battle of rhythm. Because, nope. Might be on one of these, but like the third one. Fire. Raise banner. Surely it should be here, right? Or maybe it's uh, this one. I think I want to go for... Uh, Dread Commander first with this one. The less enemy morale, the better. They seen you again. Ooh, they actually landed. Well, rip. Rip Carthaginians. Right Commander, level 3. Commander. What do you mean? First, under the first character, uh, on the on the green one. Okay, good, good to know. 
I would actually want that for fleets. I can actually upgrade these. What? Ooh. Then we'll kind of... It's on normal difficulty. Because uh, I would put the difficulty uh, game or battle difficulty up, but we can't do that. Because uh, the only like uh, challenging on the part of the mod I feel is the, the campaign, campaign gameplay. The battles are as easy as they used to be. My command will level three for lightning strike. I want to get that for the Navy so we can actually knock these guys out. Oh, look at that. It is an honor to serve Rome. Well, hello there. Steady as we go. The sea beckons. Commander. Ready for orders. Commander. Okay, which one do we want to make? I want to... I think I want to level him up, so let's make him do the attack. Uh, 70... 7% losses. Mm, I think I'm gonna do the auto resolve on this one. And that's without fleet. Playing very hard normal battles. But after a while, the enemies won't attack you anymore. That's weird. I think it's uh, just down to the AI. Thanks for the follow, by the way. I think it's just down to the AI if they like. S if you have an army anywhere near something, I don't think they're usually gonna look at it even. Or anything. Ooh, we actually lost the Stati. God damn it. Oh, no, 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 no. Why did you go that way? Yes. Yeah, shit. Actually. I mean, it's not gonna be that long to recruit all these back up. We do have a... A military wharf over there. Unfortunately, we can't get there in time. <laughs> Right, I do want to see if no mercenaries are available, apparently. Ready for orders. Uh, more Hastati I. Mm, unfortunately, not enough manpower. At your command. We hunger for battle. At one. Seventy-five percent ambush chance. What's the chance on you? Fifty. That path is blocked. March. What do you mean, like a very hard battle difficulty, but the... Wait a minute. Is that the thing? Oh, I want to find out. I don't think you can change the difficulties of the battles, can you? No, you can only change the game difficulty. But this is my first time playing Divid 8 in Paradell, so, you know, we could do a harder campaign later on. Maybe a Scartage, right? <laughs> I think I had a problem where enemies don't attack you in uh, Attila. When you beef up your settlements, if you place the garrison building inside of them as well, you know, the... Where though? Oh, I'm fucking blind or I can't read. Let's go with hard for now. Yeah, 
I'm fucking blind as a bat, apparently. Okay, what's this? This is another army. They could actually attack this. Ready for battle. Yeah, we got them both in fortification stands. <laughs> I want to see that one uh, attack us as well. To wreck him. Let's send you guys over to... What was the name of them? I think these guys. I want to get the trade agreement with them. I will listen. I cannot say for how long. Hmm. You bastards. Go take out the pirates for me. Come on. I don't want to deal with them. Greetings to you. Nope. I did say I'm gonna recruit another fleet. Let me just check things here. What's up, Medji? How are you doing? Right, we do want to upgrade these. Which one did they go for? Latrines. Oh, it's good. We're good, doing well. A Carthaginian la army landed here. We took him out easily enough. Another one, la well, one landed. One, one was uh, near the sea. There, we took them out. There was a big battle here. Last stream. Almost took an hour. Or actually, it took more than an hour. Of course, they're gonna have another stack, full stack there. And another one here. And another one here. But Hannibal died, died charging into some spears here. So that was very strategic of him. Uploading videos and taking screenshots. We could just take a, like a still from the video and just make a custom thumbnail out of it. You wanna upgrade these first? Do we have the food? No, we do not. Uh, well, the first video is out. You can see what I did. Uh, Epirus attacked Beneventum, sacked it. I was able to beat their army then there and then took them out here. Yeah, Hannibal Barker, the greatest genius in the world. Of, in the world. Well, greatest strategist in the world. Charges headlong at the wolf spears. But funnily enough, it was the like uh, Italian town guard. No, 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 actually, I think I... Uh, he charged headfirst into the... I start the Etruscan mercenaries. So he didn't die, at least he didn't die to town guard. I'll give him that. 